Don't stop believing. A little, little theme from Journey at this point in time. And I'll tell you, it's a great lead in to our little segment today on Project 351 and our representative from Charlton Middle School, Colden Blackwell, who was chosen by our faculty to actually represent Charlton at a great opportunity for leadership in uh, the city of Boston. So, Colden, first and foremost, congratulations on your recognition by our staff. Thank you. Um, talk a little bit about Project 351 and, and what you got out of that opportunity to uh, go to the State House on that particular day. It was a lot of fun. I got to meet people from all over the state and we got to just have fun and like serve the community. Okay, service for the community, and I'll tell you, that's the, uh, that's the actually backbone of what Project 351 was all about when Deval Patrick set the whole process up a long time ago. And every year we get to choose one individual who really represents that type of community involvement, service, leadership, things of that nature, and Colin, actually, you, you represent that really, really well. So on that particular day, you had a chance to uh, go to the State House, correct? And, yeah. and meet with the individuals over there? Yeah, so it was at Faneuil Hall. Okay. And, um, so we spent the first like three hours of the day, we got to listen to inspirational leaders like Governor Healy and Amari Paris Jeffries speak yep. about like leadership and what we're gonna be, and then we found out what we're gonna be doing for the day. Okay. And then we headed out on a bus to separate like spots all over Boston. Okay. And we uh, did some service projects like painting murals for um, homeless people who are getting home soon. Okay. And we painted, uh, we packaged some bags that had band-aids and stuff like first aid cookies, hand warmers for homeless people that people find on the streets. There's a there's a shelter in um, Boston that people hands, the, walk around the streets and they hand that stuff out. So, you know, it's what I consider to be an eye-opener for a lot of individuals. I mean, we live in a very nice town of Charlton. We have a lot of things yeah. that we, we should be really thankful for. But there are a lot of people out there that don't have the basic needs that, um, you know, we might have and we, we come to recognize. So, again, when you're doing things to help out the betterment of a community, uh, even if it's in greater Boston or wherever it is, I still, I still think it's a win-win. Now, what did you do for the activity? You went to a, a certain building? Yeah, so it was the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers building. Okay. And so we, uh, there was about, uh, I want to say like 75 kids in that building. We were all working together to make cards and paint and put together those kits. What did you, what was your takeaway when you left that day, you know, that opportunity to learn a, a more global perspective about leadership and helping out, you know, in different parts of the state? What, what, was, what did you take away from that? Well, it was, it felt good. I felt like a better person yeah. because I had really helped a lot of people. Actually, at the end of the thing, when we went back to Faneuil Hall, there was a number they put up there. I think it was 6,152 lives that we positively impacted that day. Think about that for a second. I bet yeah. you didn't wake up in the morning thinking you could do something like that, huh? I did not think that. You know, honestly, you know, it's one of the things, as much as we love teaching, you know, reading math, arithmetic, social studies, all that stuff, at the end of the day, we're teaching about civics. We're talking about helping kids understand civility, uh, about helping those around them, and just building stronger communities. And I think that's what Project 351 is all about. Yeah. Yeah, well, listen, Colton, I couldn't ask for a better representative for our school. Very proud of you. Um, I want to thank your family for letting you go. But more importantly, I'm very glad that you took some seeds from that type of meeting on that particular day and now bring it back to your community. I think you're going to continue to make a difference. Outstanding job, my friend. Leadership is all embedded in everything that you do. Don't ever forget that. Remember, if you can make somebody else better around you, it's a true win. So well done. Colton Blackwell, everybody. Out outstanding job, and we want to thank you once again for being our representative for Chalton Middle School for Project 351. Have a great weekend, everybody. Stay, stay well.